love that movie. But, um, yeah, I, I was like, why did I even get into that? Oh, because not seeing Morbius. Is it on Netflix? I think it's on Netflix in America now. I need to get on it. Uh oh. Call button. No! Oh, that was close. This is sorry. This poison is serious. I, I had a free sneak up attack until the regular bat. No, it didn't get to me. I wasn't close enough, I guess. No, no, I'm dead. Oh. Oh, get out of here. Dude, they are in my wheelhouse. I'm, I'm like dodging and switching spell. Dodging, switching spell. Oh, I need to get my freaking rune. Ooh, I would have been so sad. 42k. I mean, it's not a lot of where I'm at in the game, but. Getting better at uh, remembering to press right on my D-pad to switch to my weapon. Yeah, I'm almost certain I've done this whole fort too because eventually you go up there, you go into the rafters, there's like a secret, kind of a secret back there. There's a, also a giant rat and eventually you drop down, you come over here. Oh, speaking of which, I think... Mm, never mind, it might be a little later. Peru plays Chile. Chile. We need to heal quickly. Get me up this ladder. We need to heal quickly. I um, mean, bigger than Master Splinter, even. Sal, thank you so much. What you up to? Thank you for the seven months in a row. Absolute legend. Icon in the community. I actually thought I had more of these. I just popped one of these like it was nothing. I have a lot of items and I have to remind myself off stream what they do. Oh, I almost died. Imagine I got restarted because I sat there in my inventory and I died to poison. Oh, I'd have been sad. Oh! But. Oh, nice. Oh, we got ghosts. I forgot about this. I'm dead. Oh, that was a big hit. Oh, Creed, no feel good. Stop, sir. Rude. Okay. I'm gonna walk right into another one of these. Oh, ambush ghost, ghosty boys. We don't like it. my shield. Granted, I am using a tiny little snake shield. Play Wuwa? Some bats, bro. Ooh, 
Wuwa on computer? I'm so mad. No, they follow me. Madam. No, 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 no. Uh-uh. I don't think you get your items back either when you die. That's not ideal. Is Wu Wah on the computer? Buzzering Heights? Is it actually Withering Heights? And everyone just calls it Wu Wah because it's cooler? Instead of Wee Wah? There's so much going on. Go get him, boy. Again, I know the purists don't like the summon, but man, they're so cool, dude. Why would you not want the ghostly spirit of a badass knight to be... You're almost like your Pokemon battling them. Yo, I'm starting to remember. Like if you hold Ah! Get out of here. If you fall, oh, we're dead. No, we're not. If you hold L1 and press like left. That's how you can and or right. That's how you go from like two-handed to one-handed, using the shield to not. Weathering waves. Why did I say heights? Dude. No, not another one. Get out of here. Oh, no. This is a long ladder. We hate that. Oh, oh man, my my ally just spawning up here just made me do something spooky town. My ghostly knight versus your ghostly knight. It's on PC? Okay, nice. What do you, you play it on mobile though, but then you screen share? Dude, them bleeding through my shield has got to stop. Remind me to change my shield after this fight. No. Needed it. Huge. At the moment. Oh, look at them duel. No, go get him. Wow, that was rowdy, whatever he just did. Kind of made me miss my attack, but we'll talk about that later. Something just rumbled. Oh. Which one do you play more currently, Cell? Genshin, uh, Star Rail, or Wuwa?
Oh, my ally just got murked. How many of them are there? See, the secret is you give them one strong thrust in the front and then one, you know, finishing one in the back. See, and this is where you drop down in the rats and stuff, not neat. Rats. Oh, maybe they don't. Oh, there it is. That's crazy, dude. I knew there were rats here, and then I guess I like I let myself get into a false sense of security. I'm like, I guess they don't spawn back. And then the littlest rat, it's not even the big one, got me. Ooh, oh, here we go. This little, this little jump. Now here's the big one. There they are. I don't like it. Oh, I'm inside of you. I don't like it. Oh, it's fat. It's so fat. It's a fat rat. Yeah, look at you. Way to go, dum-dum. Yeah, I thought I had beaten this whole fort, but I just wanted to be sure. Oh, look at it. I hate it. It hates me. Oh, we got more. No more. No more. Sleepy time. They just try to belly flop me like Snorlax. Y'all see that? This thing's eradicate and it tried to be like a Snorlax. You know, just a reminder, kids, to always be your true self. The realest version of you. Go to Madrid. I feel like I'm supposed to crash some wood. But then again, maybe you just fast travel on out of here I'm not proud of how, uh, how tough that was, since I have already beaten this fort. Oh, oh, I forgot. dude, yes, those guys. Oh, got you. And what level are you? Are you, you say you're also 22? Twenty-six. And Alan, you said you were thirteen? And you've been seven hours. Hmm. Okay, I need to get on my grind off stream, I see. Oh, this place was cool because the first time I ever came here, you you can get teleported here essentially, right? And you get teleported here, boom. And you're standing behind like a 20 foot tall boss. 
And you're just like, and he's not aggro to you. So if you don't want to fight him, if you just want to go in here, you can. But it is spook. And look at this, dude. You feed him, like, something called Death Root, I think, if I remember correctly. You might also eventually fight him. And, you know, one of the things is you can interact with him and just call it that, and then fight this boss and call it that, but what's cool... And I'm not going to go all the way down there because I have already beaten that for sure. But if you were just like a curious gamer and just wanted to see what's around and whatnot, there's eventually a whole like, it's like its own POI, essentially. See, you eventually go down there and you parkour, you know, parkour poppy. And then you boom, boom, shimmy, shimmy, cocoa puff. You go down there and then you can get down there. And there's, there's secrets and there's, Enemies to fight, it's wild. Oh, that's cool. I love when games like uh, Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom does it even better than Breath of the Wild did, but those, you know, really tough mob, sometimes bona fide bosses just roaming in the open world. This game obviously has them too. But I like I like when games also will have them in like a caravan. So you're, it's not you going to them. Sometimes they are just, it's like a convoy, not a caravan, a convoy. There's like eight, of, eight you know, seven smaller enemies and then a big mob. You're like, okay, they're just roaming about. We've, okay, we've done most of Kaelid. We've done this. One of the hardest fights I had in the game was in this one. You have to fight like a knight and a lion at the same time. Absolutely wicked. Mm. Looks like there's a whirlpool there. All right, let's go back up here. This is kind of where I... One of the last main bosses I tried to fight, and I've tried him at least 20 times, is this cat up here. I gotta make sure I don't die on the way though. Classic, classic. Do, uh, the, do the different characters in Wuwa have different elemental types, like in Genshin? Or what kind of distinguishes them? Oh no! Just kidding, calculated. Gotcha. So obviously I had made my way through this castle at one point, many tries, beating everybody. I'm one of those, I wanna, like every one of these kind of castles, POIs, my objective is to kill every mob uh, at least once and like ideally in one play, you know, sweep. And then the subsequent times, I don't really sweat killing them again, but yeah. All right, this boss is hard as shit. We're about to dive into it. I'm probably gonna get murked. But here we go. Oh. Oh, I should have looked what my thing does. No, no. It's a three on one cheater. Okay, not what we wanted. We're about <laughs> That's not fun. Uh, 
All right, let me get my death count back up. I don't even know where it'd be. Hold on. Honestly, I can't remember if that's for God of War Ragnarok at this point or Elden Ring. 300 times in one in one stream. So you're saying I probably should double my number? Cuz that's probably true. And the real real. Huh. All right. That's legible. A little too. I can't get the D in there, but I also, it just like flaps over, you know what I'm saying? It's like either it's out of it or it's too far in it. There it is. You died two times to the bats, at least. Okay. All right, wise guy. All right, wise guy. The problem with doing that boss fight on 70k, I just realized that, is now they're kind of stuck in that loop. Like, I either... Oh! Okay, loop. We're out of the loop. We're out of it. We're not stuck in any loop. We're not stuck. We're not worried about the 70k runes anymore. That one hurts. That one hurts. I forgot you have to call back down the little elevator. Oh, that stings, dude. That really stings. It's funny, too, because I was literally going to talk about, um, like, oh, man, my runes are just going to stay. Uh... You know, like, if you have a lot of runes and you go into a boss fight, you're now committed to that boss fight. If you don't... Um... It, you know what I mean? Like, you, they're now in that boss fight arena. Oh! They're now, the, the runes are now in that arena, and the only way to get back in there to get them is to start the boss fight. So you now have to go in there and, and beat them to get it back out. So I should have kept farming, kept playing, just beating random things until I can get enough to level up. Because I was halfway there. I need like 140k. I was on about 75. I need my hat back on. Everyone knows. All right, for real, let's get this set up. I'm gonna get the death counter right and the command thing right. I think the com it would be. Hold on. Set. Um. Count. Six seven. Question mark. I'll do it by hand. Jack of Okay. Okay. This is from Elden Ring. And this must have been from probably Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Perfect. Oh, I figured that out much quicker. Also, shout out Tech Skills. He's not around um, as much anymore, but he's still a mod, and for no small reason because he was crucial in helping me figure that out. And the thing is, I actually, hell yeah, let's go. All right, let's fuck this dude up. Make sure I got my items right. Okay, this is a mixture. All damage negation temporarily makes stance break easier maximum equip load 
See, this is one of those where I shouldn't have this on, I guess, really, while doing the boss. Yes, he has two little minions, but they're hard. This is more an item you wear when you're killing people out in the open world. This one, spell casting or their FP. I think it's this that I like to rock. That boom. That's a big change. Okay, that's what that does. We're doing it. And I think actually when I was actually uh, fighting this boss a bunch of times in a row, like committed to it, um, I would remember to send it back down. So that didn't happen again. Or so, so that wouldn't happen. But it's been so long, I forgot. All right, let's do it. Oh my gosh. Dude, they are rowdy. They are rowdy. I think I got... Okay. What we started to do was do the little arc one. So I can hit multiple at once. I'm trying to do it without a summon. Oh, spider monkey. Huge. And that was the that was really efficient min maxing in the sense that my last arc cast was what killed them both. And it was my, the last one. Never mind. I'll just shut up. Anyways, you get it. It was my last little bit of my magic, uh, my mana. I'm not going to talk fight, though. I'm about to lock in. Whew. Okay, that was definitely how I dealt with the two minions. Here we go. I'm spamming it. Don't care. Doesn't matter because he's very good. Dude, he just leaps. It's crazy too that it really... So it is one of the things that one of the, the few legit criticisms of Elden Ring is as cool as a lot of the mob... I'm over here commenting again. As cool as a lot of the mob designs are, you do just start fighting them over and over again. It's like, oh, you see the Night Cowper. Badass, super cool. Then you see him in another zone, and you're like, okay, that's the one for Laernia. And then you just keep seeing him, so it kind of takes away from him a little bit. But in some regards, it's dope, because I remember the first time I ever fought one of these night type of mobs, uh -oh. uh, which was in Stormbell Castle. And how daunting they felt. And then you can feel the progression of your character. Dude, my shield just does not block for damn.
Yeah. Uh, yeah, you're right. It does do a cool attack, though. It, like, lashes out and hits them, and then it does, it poisons them. But it doesn't do me much here. It's going to be a long one. One of my favorite things about this game, of, of the thousands, is that stuff in your inventory, like, items have a weight, right? Like, what shield you're wearing versus another one or what we like weapon will make you a, a light load medium load heavy load and that'll affect your dodge rolling yada yada so they have weight but it's not like how do i word this you don't get over encumbered from carrying too many things like fallout and starfield and whatnot like i hope in uh elder scrolls 6 they do it like this where you can hold as many items as you want, stat standpoint. And that's just so, so, so dope. I, I As much as I love Fallout and Starfield and, El and Elder Scrolls, that is so frustrating. Just getting over encumbered all the time. All right, this has better defense on everything except lightning. Everything except fire. I need better lightning than fire. Defensively, I think I'm gonna do this though. I need shield crash, I think. Fight me, old man. Oh, much better. Much better damage mit mitigation. Except when he breaks my, my, my poise. The thing is, I am an intelligent build, so I'm I'm meant to be doing the the spells and stuff more. But I do like to do both. Oh yeah, I saw that. That's pretty dope. 